Well, it's EF Press on the beat, on the street, uh, opposite the mother of all tyranny. Here we are at the Supreme Court, and today in the uh, uh, Maduro board versus the Guido board of the uh, Banco Central de Venezuela, where the Bank of England have seized the Venezuelan billions of gold and are issuing credit notes to Guido in the tune of $130 million via the Deutsche Bank. And they have found in favour of the Guido board in terms of them being not accepting the Venezuelan courts of justice and uh, in a bizarre ruling they've referred it back to the commercial court to decide whether these uh, special tribunals of justice in Venezuela can but apply to the courts of the UK. So far not and under the policy of a one um, voice between the judiciary and the executive they have decided to side with the foreign secretary the foreign and commonwealth officer secretary of state and the boris johnson junta and they decided in fact to ping pong this case not dissimilar to the julian assange case where they keep ping ponging left right and center uh, to deny and delay the justice that julian uh, uh, deserves of being a free journalist, a free man and released from the torture at HMP Belmarsh and the Venezuelan the state has been very supportive of Julian and the way that these blackmail uh, 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 piracy, international piracy here uh, outside the high court has led to the uh, British government acting no better than that with a double barrel shotgun who bursts into the bank on the high street demanding an instant cash withdrawal. This is a state of British justice, it's collapsed, they're ping-ponging cases and they are denying the Venezuelans their lawful due and the trust that they put in the Bank of England has been betrayed and they have turned out to be nothing better than a 16th century privateer trawling the international waters for booty that is not theirs. The EF press outside the Supreme Court, a terrible judgment, a terrible increase in the delay and the suffering of the Venezuelan people who are denied money, not only for their urgent health care needs, but also for putting food upon the table of the young, the old, and the whole families in Venezuela that are dependent on having these aids and having these uh, uh, socialist packages provided for the people uh, in Venezuela, unlike in the UK. EF Press, I've had enough of these judges. They're a bunch of crooks.